Our next step in the tutorial is to create a network data set based on the road layer. At the moment, the roads and our points for employment and for Bowen Hills do not exactly connect. So by creating a network data set, it adds pieces of information to each segment of the road and allows us to create this data set. So the first step, make sure your extensions are turned on for Network Analyst. And they are. Close. Open Art Catalog. Navigate through to the road network and at this point it's probably easier to work on Art Catalog outside of GIS. So go to the Start menu and click on Art Catalog. Once Art Catalog is open, navigate through to your data. Week 3 data and road network. Right click anywhere in the open space, head down to new, and then click on network. Whoops, hang on. Right click new. That's not opening. Hang on a sec. Right now, I'm not sure why it's not letting me do it in the network data set here. So if I close our catalog, come back into GIS, right click on road net, new network data set and that opens up our data set. ArcGIS will come up with its own default name. This is fine for our purposes, so click Next. This is where, if there are other data that we can use to create a network, it will show up here and where you can tick it. As we have none, just click Next to the next part. At this stage, we don't, um, we don't want to change these settings, so we'll just click Next. When we come to connectivity, click on the connectivity button. In the connectivity section, we want to make sure that it is checked. By having it checked, it means that one road segment will connect to other pieces and will create a network. So click OK and then click Next. We have no elevation data in this tutorial, so click Next again. This next window is where we set impedances on the network. As we don't have any other information here, it is set default to meters, and this will automatically calculate it for us. Because we're looking at accessibility and distance, um, this is what we need. So click next to come through to the next part. When we in some GISs, you can choose uh, directions on each roads. This is a bit advanced for us, and we don't need it for our exercise. So click next. It will then provide a summary of information where we can click Finish. And GIS will create the network data sets to help us with our accessibility. Yes. Once that is done, you will notice that ArcGIS has created a road network and also road network junctions. So we now want to open our road net database. Click Yes. Head back into the table of contents and let us just uncheck a few things to make it visible. So this is our road network. These are all the segments of the road. We also have additional edges, the road itself, and junction points in the GIS. And that is our road network.